Okay, so you have completed your parallel circuit. Now you need to move on to your series circuit. So this is the one where everything goes around in a circle. So we're not using a circle. This is your series circuit and you are going to want to put this on the right side of your journal. So if this is the center line. Your journal is here. You want this to go on this side so you can fold that corner. And you need to label this page series circuit and put today's date, which 12-4, 12-8, 12-7, whenever you're working on this, okay? And then just like before, you're gonna need to glue this down. So we don't wanna glue this flat. If you just fold it over along that dotted line, then you'll know, oh, that was bad. And if you fold a little bit better, okay. You're gonna wanna put glue all the way around. You want this nice and secure in your journal, okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And for those of you who are a little bit neater working in this grip, feel free to cut off that chunk. You won't need it. Okay, we're going to put this down just like so. And we have our flap loose. And if you accidentally glue it down, that's fine. You have that. That's a-okay. We've got this. Now let's look at this. You have your battery spot. You have your LED spot. You have a corner. Corners are tricky and we have you have to follow a step that I'm gonna show you for your corners. You have two other angles. As we do corners, remember, doll side up. So if we start with doll side up, as we go around this corner, we need to make sure doll side is up. And this has to be one piece of foil. We aren't cutting the foil, that'd be like cutting the wire. And all along here has to be one piece of foil. So you are going to need for this, you're gonna need the all circuit diagram. You're going to need your foil. You're going to need your battery again. Okay. And you're going to need another LED. For this diagram, I want you to get your yellow LED. Okay. So we have all that stuff ready to go. And again, you're going to need tape and glue and scissors. So we have all of this stuff ready to go. Once again, we are going to cut a strip because we're gonna tackle this one first. So the strip should be about as wide as your finger. Let's go ahead and cut this. Try to cut it as straight as possible. You want this as smooth as possible. Okay, now, secrets to doing this corner. What we're gonna do is we're gonna glue down this direction then we're going to take this foil, oh wait, doll side up, Miss Fear, doll side up. Okay, so we're gonna glue this down, and then we're going to take this, and we're gonna fold it back on itself, then we're gonna put our finger right where we want it to go, and then we're gonna fold it back to that direction, so it'll go along here. So step one, put glue, glue, along the first line you want it to go on. So we're going to place this, remember you go from this edge to this edge, don't rip it this time. So we put it down and doll side is up, which means doll side needs to be up over here. So we're going to fold it back along itself right to where that corner is. Okay. Now we are going to, you know what, let's practice folding. So you're going to put your finger along here and you're going to put your finger right along the line where you want it to go. It's a little awkward in the camera. You're going to fold it back on itself toward your finger and then you're going to push it down. So you can see we made a nice corner and it's doll side to doll side. So that's good. If you don't fold it back on itself and you just go this, you just went doll side, shiny side. That's bad, no. You need to make sure you fold it back on itself and then fold it up the direction you want it to go. And then go ahead and go lift it up and put the glue down and go ahead and place this down and then tear off the excess. Okay? So just like that. So we have that one done. Now we need to do it again for this side. And none of our pieces are long enough, so we're going to need to cut a new piece of foil for this. So 
So there's our foil. Okay, so we're gonna start here. We're gonna put our glue down first. Put the glue down. Okay, then again, doll side up. So we're gonna place this down. Okay, then we're gonna fold it back on itself, directly on top. And we're gonna put our finger where we want it to go and we're gonna fold it back over to our finger and then push it down. Okay, and then we're gonna take our glue and put the glue down and place it down. Okay, so once again, we need to do this again to get it all the way around. We're gonna fold it back on itself then we're going to put our finger where we want it to go and fold it down towards our finger. Push it down so it's nice and flat. And then lift it back up so you can take a peek and put the glue down. And then put it down. And then tear off your excess. All that's extra. So we have a nice circuit where we have doll side all the way around. This has to be one piece. Has to be one piece. This has to be one piece of foil. Do not cheat. It will not be reliable. Okay. Now, we're going to take our LED. And again, we have the long side of our LED and the short side of our LED. You see that? Focus, camera. There you go. We want the long side of our LED to go around the long side of our circuit. And we want the short side of our LED to go around the short side of our circuit. So I need to flip it over. You're just going to, you see that? Bend the leads and then place it down onto my circuit where it says to go. Just like that. So make sure the metal part of your LED is on the metal part of your circuit. Then you're gonna make your little teeny tiny pieces. See, remember, smaller is better. These are like little band-aids of foil that you're gonna put over the metal part of your LED. So the tape's the sticky part of your band-aid, that's like the gauze part. So take your tape, little piece of tape. Use that to pick up the foil of your circuit, or sorry, foil. And you're going to, remember, put this across your LED. So we're going to put the foil down on the LED first, and it needs to make sure, make sure this foil, oh, glare, glare. Okay, make sure this foil, glare. Okay, you can do that. Uh, make sure the foil is going across your LED lead and it's touching the foil underneath and then push it down and then push down the rest of your tape so it should be nice and tight. Maybe use your fingernail to get in there and make sure it's nice and tight. I'm going to do that again. Let me find my little strip. There it is. So we're going to pick up our piece of foil. There it is. And we're going to go right across the lead of our LED. See? So we put the foil part down on top of the metal part first, push down with your nails, either side, and then go out and around, okay? And when you're using your tape in this, make sure that piece of foil, there we go, make sure that piece of foil is small enough that you still have sticky tape all around it. Like, there should be tape all around it. So if it's too big, it's not going to stick down, okay? So we have our LED attached, now we need to test our circuit to make sure it works. So take your battery out of its house, come here little battery, out, come out, come out, come out. Okay, take out your battery. Now, if we did this correctly, because long side of LED is along the long side, that means that goes to the plus side of our battery, so we're going to place it right here. Negative side of our battery touches the negative side of our circuit. And if we flip this edge over so that this foil touches that side of our battery, you should get your LED to light up, okay? Remember, the first thing, if it doesn't work, the first thing you should do, flip over your battery. And then if it still doesn't work, flip your battery back over the right direction and touch these and make sure that, and push down and make sure that your metal leads are touching the foil. There should be no glue, no tape, and no paper between the foil and the metal of your LED because that's what conducts the electricity. So once you know that you have it working, you need to label this. So for my circuit, positive side is up. So we're going to label this positive side up. And then again, I need to label my circuit. So this is the positive side and this is the negative side. So that if anyone comes and looks in my journal and wants to test my circuit, that's what it is. 
Now once you're done, remember you need to show me a video where you are showing me it done, and then you go like this. I need to see all of that. If I don't see all of that, you're not going to get full credit. I need to see that your journal is titled. I need to see plus side up. I need to see negative side, positive side. I need to see that this is the positive side and this is the negative side. And I need to see it working. And then once you're done, put your battery back in its house, put it back in the Ziploc baggie, and put everything back in your bag for safekeeping until you're ready to do your next circuit. Have fun with this. It's fun. You get to make stuff light up.